welcome you all to a new episode of first year higher secondary mathematics classes chapter 1 sex my item for tandil some basic formula here if capital a is any set then first a union a equal to a second a intersection a equal to a trivial result proof x element of a union b mean x element of either a or b therefore a union a equal to x such that x element of a or x element of a equal to x element of a that is equal to a therefore a union a equal to a a trivial result second we have x element of a intersection b means x belongs to both a and b therefore a intersection a equal to set x such that x element of a and x element of a equal to x element of a equal to a therefore a intersection a equal to a identity law if capital a is any set and phi is the null set then first a union phi equal to a second a intersection u equal to a a union phi equal to x such that x element of a or x element of phi we have if x element of a union b then x element of either a or x element of b equal to set x such that x element of a equal to a therefore a union phi equal to a second we have the meaning of intersection that is if x belongs to a intersection b is x belongs to both a and b therefore a intersection u equal to set x such that x belongs to capital a and x belongs to capital u equal to set x such that x belongs to capital a equal to a therefore a intersection u equal to capital a some trivial results theorem if capital a capital b capital c are any three sets then first a union b equal to b union a this is called commutative law of union second a intersection b equal to b intersection a commutative law of intersection third a union b union c equal to a union b union c associative law of union fourth a intersection b intersection c equal to a intersection b intersection c associative law of intersection fifth a union b intersection c equal to a union b intersection a union c distributive law of union six a intersection b union c equal to a intersection b union a intersection c distributive law of union fifth is called distributive law of union over intersection sixth is also called distributive law of intersection over union proof let x be an arbitrary element of a union b then x belongs to a union b implies and implied by x belongs to capital a or x belongs to capital b implies and implied by x belongs to capital b or 
X belongs to capital A. Implies and implied by X belongs to B union A. Therefore, A union B equal to B union A. Second, let X be an arbitrary element of A intersection B. Then X belongs to A intersection B implies and implied by X belongs to capital A and X belongs to capital B. This is the definition of intersection. Implies and implied by X belongs to capital B and X belongs to capital A. We interchange this A and B. Implies and implied by X belongs to B intersection A by definition of intersection. Therefore, A intersection B equal to B intersection A. Third, let X be an arbitrary element of A union, B union C. Then X belongs to A union, B union C. Implies and implied by X belongs to capital A or X belongs to B union C. Implies and implied by X belongs to capital A or X belongs to B or X belongs to C. B changes the bracket. Implies and implied by X belongs to capital A or X belongs to capital B or X belongs to capital C. Implies and implied by X belongs to A union B or X belongs to C. Implies and implied by X belongs to A union B, union C. Therefore, A union B union C equal to A union B, union C. Fourth, let X be an arbitrary element of A intersection, B intersection C. Then X belongs to A intersection, B intersection C implies and implied by X belongs to capital A and X belongs to B intersection C. Here we use the definition of intersection. Intersection means and. Implies and implied by X belongs to capital A and X belongs to capital B and X belongs to capital C. Implies and implied by X belongs to capital A and X belongs to capital B and X belongs to capital C. Implies and implied by X belongs to A intersection B and X intersection C. We use the definition of intersection that is and. Implies and implied by X belongs to A intersection B intersection C. Therefore, A intersection B intersection C equal to A intersection B intersection C. Fifth, let X be an arbitrary element of A union B intersection C. Then X belongs to A union B intersection C. Implies and implied by X belongs to capital A or X belongs to B intersection C. Here we use union for or. Implies and implied by X element of A or X element of B and X element of C. Implies and implied by X element of A or X element of B and X element of A or X element of C. Implies and implied by X element of A union B and X element of A union C. Implies and implied by X element of A union B intersection A union C. Therefore, A union B intersection C equal to A union B intersection 
A union C. Six. Let X be an arbitrary element of A intersection B union C. Then X element of A intersection B union C implies and implied by X element of A and X element of B union C implies and implied by X element of A and X element of B or X element of C implies and implied by X element of A and X element of B or X element of A and X element of C implies and implied by X element of A intersection B or X element of A intersection C implies and implied by X element of A intersection B union A intersection C therefore A intersection B union C equal to A intersection B union A intersection C some Venn diagrams let U be the universal set we have A dash equal to U minus A that is outside of A is called A dash figure 1 let U be the universal set then set A figure 2 from figure 1 and figure 2 we have A union A dash equal to U the universal set also A intersection A dash equal to null set 5 also A dash all dash complement of A dash equal to A that is A dash is outside of A outside of A dash is A itself let u be the universal set then u dash means no element in the set u dash equal to 5 that is null set figure 3 also we have phi dash equal to u no element is in the set and its complement is the universal set that is all element in the set. Properties of complement sets. We studied A union A dash equal to U. A intersection A dash equal to phi. A dash all dash equal to A. Phi dash equal to U. U dash equal to phi cardinal number or cardinality let capital A be any finite set then cardinal number or number of elements of capital A is denoted by n of A example let capital A equal to set 1, 3, 5, 7, 9 that is number of elements in capital A is 5 